What with open world games taking the industry by storm, we figured it would be a great idea to show you what the future has in store for the genre. I'm Ernest for What to Play, and these are the 29 upcoming open world games for the year 2018 and beyond. Arranged by release date's first game on our list is Warhammer 40k Inquisitor Martyr. The Caligari Sector awaits you from Necrocore Games' latest Warhammer entry. It features a multitude of classes that shape the future of ARPGs. Take a plunge into its grim portrayal of the future and become the protector of the solar systems. It's coming out this August 23, 2018 on the Xbox One and PlayStation 4. Yakuza Kiwami 2 A ground-up remake of the 2006 Yakuza 2 developed using the Dragon Game Engine from Yakuza 6. This action-adventure is set in a sprawling open-world Japan played in a third-person perspective like most Yakuza games. It follows the same plot as Yakuza 2, but with added new features to gameplay, bonus content, and new story. It's coming this 28th of August on the PlayStation 4. Divinity Original Sin 2 The sequel to Larian Studios' award-winning RPG. Master the art of magic and tactical combat and join up to three players in the most seamless turn-based co-op adventure yet. Choose your own character and go anywhere as you interact with its sprawling fantasy world. Coming out this August 31st on the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Xenoblade Chronicles 2 Torna The Golden Country The first and the latest expansion from Nintendo's acclaimed JRPG. Set 500 years before the events of the original game, guide a group of legendary warriors on a journey through a tragic history that doomed their kingdom to darkness. Players can get this game as an expansion or a standalone DLC. It comes out this 21st of September on the Switch. Assassin's Creed Odyssey Ubisoft returns with their annual AC games and this time it's set in ancient Greece. Like its predecessors, it takes you to a huge open world of Greece to explore. Witness the badassery of the legendary Greek warriors and choose between two main characters with different genders. It's coming out this October 2 on the PC, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4. Red Dead Redemption 2 The Wild West beckons in this refreshing sequel of Rockstar's critically acclaimed open-world action game. Story details are still scarce at the moment, and not much gameplay was shown. It's still a blur for us, but let's hope for no delays this time. We can't wait once the game releases this October 26, 2018 on the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Just Cause 4 Building a new engine from the ground up, this fourth installment is built on better foundations, so expect the excitement to ramp up. There will be more things to destroy with each area fitting for your explosive delights. Coming this December 4 on the PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. Biomutant THQ Nordic's latest venture takes you to a beautiful open-world experience filled with mutant animals with kung fu powers. It's a whole new take on the third-person adventure. Think of it as Rocket Raccoon meets Kung Fu Panda. No release date yet, but it's coming out on the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and the PC. Dreams An open-ended, community-centric experience where you can make anything you can think of. With limits. I guess. Create your very own dreamlike video game genre ranging from shoot 'em ups, puzzlers, platformers, and so much more. Explore the game's story mode if you're lost during the first few hours. No release date yet, but it's coming exclusively on the PlayStation 4 this year. Church in the Darkness An unlikely indie adventure game with a story rich narrative. From Paranoid Productions, infiltrate a mysterious religious organization that sends signals throughout your gameplay. Obviously inspired from the Herring Jonestown Massacre, but hopefully with no Kool-Aid this time. Coming out sometime this 2018 on the PC, PS4, and Xbox One. DayZ One of the earliest early access games that still hasn't seen the light of day. Bohemia Interactive zombie survival game takes you to an open world with 60 players per server. Like most survival game experiences, craft, fight, make weapons, and laugh at the game's ridiculous glitches. Coming out this 2018, hopefully on the PC, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4. One Piece World Seeker An open-world One Piece game is just what everyone needs right now. Bandai Namco's take on Ichiro Oda's masterpiece takes you onto the Great Seas. Enter a whole new story from Luffy's point of view and meet new and iconic characters from the One Piece universe. Coming this 2018 on the PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. Ashen An action RPG from Aurora 44. Hope is at its faintest as you wander a dark and gritty world. Cross paths with various players from around the world and survive together as you craft new abilities and bolster your defenses. Coming this 2018 on the PC and Xbox One. Absolver 
Slow Claps multiplayer martial arts game takes you to a massive online arena where players are placed behind the mask to determine their worth in mighty combat. Engage in the game's unique free-flowing real-time combat system and experiment with various styles to gain the upper hand. It's coming out sometime this 2018 on the Xbox One. If only there was a way to see all the upcoming games, right? Well, lucky for you, you can check the complete list on whattoplay.com by clicking the first link right here below. Cube Life Island Survival A direct port of their old Wii U version, this title's voxel-based universe puts a deeper focus on the everyday survival of the island life. Make like the guy from Castaway and try to weather the storms and hurdles of your lonely sand prison. Meet the beasts that roam around and craft like your life depends on it. Coming this 2018 on the PS4 and Switch. Shenmue 3 The delay took a heavy toll for most of the fans. This is the most anticipated Shenmue entry ever. Its recently released trailer shows the game's callback to the classic art style and animation, but not much details were revealed as of the moment. It comes out next year on the PC and PlayStation 4. Crackdown 3 We completely forgot that this game was still coming. This year's E3 gave this the last type of their career because the legendary Terry Crews is taking center stage. This open-world third-person shooter is a chaotic and testosterone-filled adventure, and it's coming out this 22nd of February 2019 on the PC and Xbox One. Days Gone Sony's upcoming exclusive isn't taking you to Norse realms or a new dawn of mechanical age. This time, it's a post-apocalyptic world filled with the undead. Play as Deacon St. John as he explores a violent new world infested with freakers. It's coming out this February 22, 2019 as a PlayStation 4 exclusive. The Sinking City An open investigation thriller game with heavy Lovecraftian elements. Discover the strange land straight out of H.P. Lovecraft's mind. Encounter creatures of nightmare and weave through a narrative defined by your choices. It's coming out this March 21, 2019 on the PC. Rage 2 Bethesda's latest Rage title is probably their most insane open-world shooter yet. It introduces their main character, Walker, as he journeys around his wasteland for some rare items. With new abilities, a collector's edition tease, and a whole lot of weapon variety, Rage 2 is going to be one hell of a party. It's coming out this spring 2019 on the PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. Cyberpunk 2077 One of the biggest things to come out of E3 2018, CD Projekt Red's most anticipated game after The Witcher's success brings us to a whole new world. Enter a cyberpunk society and choose your own class in this first-person open-world RPG. It promises to be the best RPG CD Projekt Red creates. No release date yet, but it's coming out to the PC, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4. Dead Island 2 Although Dying Light 2 is a go, Techland isn't holding back with her latest sequel to the zombie-infested first-person adventure. Not much gameplay details were unveiled, but expect it to be bigger than the original, and maybe a Battle Royale mode. No release date yet, but it's coming out on the Xbox One, PC, and PlayStation 4. The Forest An open-world survival horror game from End Night Games. After waking up from a plane crash, find yourself in a mysterious forest filled with cannibals. Use any means necessary to see the light of day. Meet with new players and try your dandest to live. It's coming out to the PlayStation 4 sometime soon. Shakedown Hawaii A parody of the high-octane life of big business, step into the shoes of a new player in the corporate circle and worm your way into property acquisition, shakedowns, and sabotage. It's an open world that's free for exploration and financial exploitation. No release date yet, but it's coming to the PC, PS4, Nintendo Switch, PlayStation Vita, 3DS, and maybe the Xbox One. Dragon Quest Builders 2 The sequel to the original Dragon Quest Builders. This will feature stuff not present during the first game including slopes, waterfalls, and underwater swimming. Additional features include a new hang glider to traverse places quickly. But the game's biggest addition is its multiplayer. Not much details yet, but it's coming to the Switch and PlayStation 4. Ghost of Tsushima Become the ghost in this Japanese open-world adventure from Sucker Punch Games. Set in feudal Japan in the 13th century, play as the last samurai in this devastated land. Coming exclusively to the PlayStation 4. No story, gameplay details, and release date yet. Elder Scrolls 6 Perhaps E3's biggest surprise. The latest entry to Bethesda's award-winning series is now in development. 
Unfortunately, the only info we're shown was a title screen with no details. I guess we're gonna have to wait for next year. Coming to the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC. Star Citizen This upcoming MMO sci-fi game from Cloud Imperium began its development way back 2011. It's being crowdfunded at a staggering rate, and it might prove to be a competitor to famous sci-fi space trading games like Elite Dangerous and probably No Man's Sky. No release date yet, but it's coming to the PC. Ashes of Creation Enter a fallen world untouched by civilization for a thousand years. Rebuild, repopulate, and rediscover the beauty behind it. A vast open world awaits the players and you decide what to do with your newfound freedom. No release date yet, but it's coming to the PC. Thank you so much for watching our video. You think we missed anything? Any favorites? Anything you personally were excited for? We could always discuss right here in the comment section. If you want to get these games right now or check out our website at whattoplay.com, the links are provided in the description box below. To get all the What to Play updates, don't forget to subscribe and ring that little notification bell. So that's pretty much the video, and I'm off.